I just got robbed, man, and I got robbed in the coolest way possible. So look, man, this is how my day started off. What? But it was in the dopest way possible. So look what happened, right? So I'm on this car part sale page that my city runs or whatever. So I listed up a boot coil loads I had sitting in the yard for about like, I don't know, like two or three weeks or whatever. I don't think it's been that long, but whatever, man. Y'all don't care. So some girl messaged me like, hey, I'll give you 20 bucks for the suspension when I get off of work. I was like, I, right, you know what? Cool, come get it. I need a gun. I was only listening to them for 30 bucks, so... I was gonna use the 20 to go buy more to come back from this one dude. So I was like, all right, come get him. She's like, okay. So around like three o'clock, Amanda came over, right? So we went to go get some food and we was like driving around for like an hour and a half. First we went to Zaxby's, then we went to Hurricanes, no, Buffalo Wild Wings, then we went to Hurricanes and this all took like an hour and a half to go get. What are you doing? What are you doing? Yeah, you can. This is a snowball microphone, fool. All right, so look, so. An hour and a half of me and her driving around trying to find some some food to eat or whatever. We finally settled for some wings and pizza from Pizza Hut. So we get there, we get back home. It's like 5:40, 5:50, right? And the girl was blowing my phone up. She was like, "Hey, where you at?" No, she ain't said out loud. She was like, "Hey, I just got off work. Can I come pick him up?" Question mark. Then another question mark. I was like, "Oh, my bad. I just got home. Sorry. Yeah, come get him." Gave her my address to come scoop him up, and guess what? She came to the house, but it wasn't just her. No, nigga, it wasn't her. It was her fiance, Mexican dude, right? So his nigga was cool as hell. Like, this nigga had like a cool beard, you know what I'm saying? Nice little flat top. Uh, I don't know what he had on his head, but it was dope. So we, I gave him the suspension, right? So we started talking about cars and my girlfriend's car, about how it's dipped and how who did the dip, and it's nice. Then he told me he had a four-door EG with an H-swap from Japan to Euro. It's a Euro to H22A1, I don't know, something like that. That's something he was saying. So I was like, yeah, that's cool, man. So we just kept talking about cars. Then guess what, nigga? He hit me with this. All right, man, I'm going to get out of here. I said, all right, man, you have a good way home, man. You have a good way home. And... A damn fool. He got in the car and drove off so fast. Nigga did like six pulls down the block. Man robbed me for $20. I got robbed in the coolest way possible because he's in the cars. So he robbed me for a good cause. You know what I'm saying? I need to get my $20 back, man. She ain't mess. The girl don't even want to message me back now. Isn't that crazy how you get robbed like that? You know what I'm saying? I said, look, lady. I said, oh, snap. I forgot the money. She ain't read my message. I said, yo, I forgot to get the $20. LOLs. Still ain't read my message, but when I give him my address, I got five messages in return. Okay, cool. At Dollar Tree on Jennings. Be there in five. I'm here. But now she don't want to write me back. She did that, man. I be getting robbed, man. But I got robbed in the coolest way possible, so it was all good. You know what I'm saying? I'm hopefully get my money back later today because I want to go buy this Mortal Kombat, man. $20 for Mortal Kombat? X, nigga? Come on, son. It's... You need to buy me some damn ice cream. I ain't buying you nothing. But uh, love y'all, man. Thank y'all for watching me. Uh, watching. Thank y'all for listening to me getting robbed. I know y'all got better things to do watching nigga get robbed. But uh, I'm gonna catch y'all later, man. Peace. Subscribe to my channel. Be